Hi everybody, so today I'm going to show you how to refill a Febreze car air freshener using some essential oil. Um, I've chosen this vanilla and coconut smell, um, but you can choose whatever you want. So, um, what you'll need for this is a screwdriver, essential oil, one of old used Febreze for air freshener, and then a um, syringe with a blunt tip um, needle on the end and the principle is that we're going to use this to puncture the bubble here and put some oil mixture with water uh, back into here but first of all I'm just going to uh, show you how to dismantle this um, mechanism because it'll make it easier to clean out any old oil that might still be left in there. So essentially this um, grey cover is just pressed onto the outside of this black backing. So get the screwdriver down in there and just Right, your way in. There we go. So it's just popped it up. It's just unclipping now. Just move the screwdriver around. There we go. So that's the backing bit, and then this is the container that contains the fluid. Um, just going to pop that out. There we go, so that's the outer casing, that's the bubble that we're going to be refilling and essentially this one I've already utilised and basically we're going to be putting this into there and uh, injecting uh, a combination of water and oil into it. What I'm going to do first of all is just fill up the syringe with water. And then I'm just going to flush that out, make sure there's no old smells in there. So I'll do that a couple of times. Um, also by filling this up, we'll know exactly how much fluid is inside there so we won't use too much fluid when we refill it. So I'm just going to wash this out a couple of times and then I'll be back. So I've cleaned this out, cleaned out the syringe and the glass. You'll be surprised to see how much oil there is floating around in the water. Um, to do this one, um, it really depends on how strong a smell that you're going to want to have. Um, probably something in the region of 10 to 20 drops is going to be sufficient. Um, if you don't particularly like strong smells, then you may want to use less. So, I'm just going to fill this back up with a fluid, water. There's a little bit of a air gap in there, so we're just going to suck this back out. You could do this in situ, but one of the benefits of dismantling to do this is that you're not going to distort the um, case 
and also you can just move this around to suck out all of the fluid. In situ it's very difficult to get it past the frame. A little bit left in there. So essentially you can see that the syringe is half full to fill up the container. So I'm going to clean this water out and then I'm going to add the oils first to the syringe and then add a little bit of water. Okay. So empty syringe. I need to put my finger over the end so it doesn't fall out. And then simply drip one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Right, as you can see, there's a small amount of fluid in there. down and then draw some more fluid up so we're half full pop that into there Well, yeah, that is all full. Then simply pop it back into the frame. There we go, that is all ready to pop into the car and you can still vary the amount of scent that you want like you would before. Um, I hope this has been a helpful video, um, if you could like and subscribe that will help expand the channel. Thank you, bye bye.